Hi students, welcome to short observer classes. Now we have an experimental setup we can see here. Well, this is our setup, and we have to identify the process by which this can be explained. Okay, and we have four options. And the first one says development of suction force due to transpiration. Second one is measuring the rate of transpiration. Third one is demonstration of ascent of sap. And the fourth one is demonstration of anaerobic respiration. Well, this one is the process that is we are measuring the we are measuring the rate of rate of transpiration transpiration so for further explain i would like to insert a page okay so in this process when water is lost water is lost then what happening that the process of transpiration that okay this is the process of transpiration so i'm just writing it in this way let me use the eraser and Okay. So this is the process of transpiration. Transpiration. I already told you that to measure the rate of transpiration. Okay. So now, when by this process water is lost, water that is is lost from leaves. from leaves then what is happening in the next step that is if this is step 1 in the step 2 that the glass tube absorbed and the glass tube is absorbed and as a result in the third step what is happening the mercury level or i rather say ag so the ag level that increases so water is lost by this process from leaves then the water from glass tube that is absorbed i must write here water h2 that is from glass tube that is absorbed and in the next step this Ag that is rises or increases. So this is all about the transpiration in short. And let's get back to the question. So okay. So in the question we have that process that experimental system that can be explained by the process of transpiration. i in the next question we have okay so now we have a question on meiotic division so in meiotic division there is four daughter cells that are produced by the two successive division in which so meiotic division has four daughter cells are produced by two successive division means there is two way or two step that is meiotic division 1 and meiotic division 2 these are the steps and that produces four daughter cells okay so let's see what we have asked here that in which what happens 
there are four statements okay first one is first division is reductional and the second division is equational okay in the next one first division is equational and second division is reductional okay this is just the opposite see this one was first division was reductional and second was equational and here the first division is equational and the second one is reductional okay fine so in the third option what we have let's see that the both divisions are equational and in the option d both division are reductional okay so first let me draw this for you I'm just changing my pin color okay suppose this is the cell that is 2n in number in case of human that is 46 yeah. okay whatever in the next step that is in first matrix division that is first one we are getting in and another n and there in the second division we will get that is the second division will get there two cell that is in and this is also in means they are 23 23 and here in the second division we will get the same in and in so let's see one thing that we have 46 chromosome and then in the next step we have 23 numbers so this is reduction there were 2 n double of n and now we had in this step only single n so this is the reduction so there is the reduction in step 1 and in the step 2 we have another time n that is equational the equal number of daughter cell are producing so let's see the first option that is the first division is reductional and the second is equational yes this will be the correct answer answer will be option a as first one is giving n number of chromosome and in the second mitotic division it again gives n number of chromosome and at the last from one cell this will be one two three four four daughter cells are producing four daughter cells daughter cells so this will be the correct answer i hope you understand this question so option a will be the correct answer so thank you for watching this video